Someone has made this place a letter. The symbol of the snake is on it. Hmm. Khaliset is clearly working with the order. And they don't know she took some of the silica for herself. What was worth the danger of crossing the order? This is where Khaliset slept. Protected from sandstorms. The lotus flower of rebirth. She must have picked these for a reason. Now why would one of her loyal beasts be caged? tomb. She has detailed every crevice. Ah, she has not finished. That is where I will find her. I will head to the pyramids. Hyenas. Khaliset must be inside.
to enter here where silence has befallen her. A Magi who has treaded many dunes to find you. Hide if you must, Hyena. But this tomb will not protect you. I demand that you stop here. Turn back now and I will excuse this intrusion. Siwa was an intrusion. man, I am Iset, possessor of magic. The gods live here, not you. What sort of mischief is she entertaining? This trap door. What is it protecting? Heathen! The wakeful one is asleep! Go no further, or I will drench these arid plains with your blood! What is this place? A tomb beneath a tomb. Is this where you hide, hyena? Some madness happened here. A dark place with a window to the gods. What kind of ritual is she performing?
Offerings to Osiris. Protector of the dead. Hmm. Alisa drew these symbols here. Was she trying to figure out their meaning? Still warm. And the ceremonial knife. This was a sacrifice. And this sarcophagus is decorated with goddesses of the mother. Strange symbols are marked all over it. I think I know what Dark Deeds Haliset was after here. Haliset was doing a ritual. She began by calling to Osiris with these offerings. She used a knife to sacrifice her captives. She collected their blood for some dark purpose. She was attempting to learn these strange symbols. She must have found them in this room. Once she knew the symbols, she carved them here and ended the ritual with one final prayer over the sarcophagus. Haliset must be trying to bring someone back to life. But just who is buried down here? Transmission, Segment 3, Acquiring Contemporaneity. It has been 95 days since the Great Catastrophe. The Messenger speaks. You must be wondering why I have reached out to you. It was written, you see, that you would come to this particular chamber at this very moment in time. The walls told us of your coming when we once were. Look at them. Are they not fascinating? These walls tell of a tragic story. A story we transcribed on our structures, on our artifacts. A story we could not alter. A mystery defying us in plain sight. We tried. Our scholars and scientists, poets and physicists, bright minds, rebellious hearts. They all tried so hard to bring about change. They, we all failed. None could change what we discovered, the stories written into the walls of these rooms. By whom, we never knew. We know they tell of the future that is, the future that was, and the future that is yet to come. The Zeros? We failed at modifying the line. We failed at adding a single dot. It was clear. We were to be messengers at best. But messengers to whom? To you. We removed our ability to read those stories from your original template. A doorway that is also a puzzle. We must find a solution. Those were Brutus's words when he visited the vault under the Colosseum more than 2,000 years ago. He drew the vault, sketched it to the best of his abilities, but he could not see. Just as you are blind, you may read your watch, you may read hourglasses and calendars, but you cannot grasp beyond that simplistic surface. For now, the true reading of time still escapes you. And so today, the curtains pulled and the arrows is shown. Tragic and complete. Those walls you might never read. Events yet unfold as written. But something, 
Anything must change. You do not understand what is at stake. The reader has no power. He is but an observer. But the author? The author invents the future. The author owns the future. A future where zeros are avoided. A future where a loved one can be revived by the drafting of a new chapter. A future where humankind is more than it is today. A future where, just perhaps, we can all still exist together. Child. My child! You lost your child. I haven't. Her rest is temporary. You have intervened on her reawakening. And yet you aligned yourself to the Order. Ravaged this tomb. Halicet! Don't you dare say my name! My name does not merit your lips, you who have dishonored her. I am a good mother. You are no match for me, desert scum! resurrection. I will show you what happens to those who desecrate my daughter's tomb.
in pursuit of the impossible, Haliset. No measure of magic can bring our children back. Obstenu got clear. Instead, hyena. Come only for you, hyena. The gods need not be involved. You are in pursuit of the impossible, Haliset. No measure of magic can bring our children back. Let's keep my mouth closed. Save my daughter no matter the cost! Enough of your 
Then heed my weapon instead, hyena! <laughs> this is who they send after me! He bugs on my beasts are fearsome! You would be best to give yourself up, Haliset. I know your pain! You know nothing of my pain! No child would want this from their parents, hyena! Do not speak of what my child wants! You are handy with a weapon! I will give you that! Egypt will be well rid of you! Do I walk among the dead now? A just end. You defiled the dead and enabled the people who killed my son. All on a selfish whim. No. I gathered the silica for them. It powered the magic stone of those who came before. You saw it, didn't you? The symbols only needed to be learned. It is not meant for us. It makes no difference now. I wanted to protect my daughter in life and death. I have done neither. Osiris! Please grant me reunion! She walks alone in the field of reeds. Am I to remain in the Duat Laeva? I just want my daughter back! Find your daughter in the afterlife, Haliset. May the Lord of the Duat guide you.
ancient writing from the Old Kingdom. <laughs> Do I need to deal with you? Harriet, look at Yahoo! You dare accuse me, you coward? You who spent the past three... Perhaps we forgot some part of the ritual. I will vomit if I hear more. Have no doubt of this. If our child dies, I die. No, my lotus, do not speak like that. I must go to the seer's house. Please leave me be. Priest. Ah, ah, I, I'm, I'm sorry. I'm, uh... I have come to seek the lizard. Oh, the lizard. One more affliction for Memphis. The city withers in the darkness of a curse. Disease, pestilence, the poison stink of the air. 
The ape is ghoul sickened nearly unto death. Gods have abandoned us. The people look to me for guidance, but I am as lost as they. Hush! <laughs> you Pash. because that is even my own house my wife time hotep has miscarried three times this year she's with child again but if if she loses a fourth <laughs> mm. I will look into this curse my wife's seer can help his house is to the southwest. If the gods are responsible, I will kneel beside you as they strike us down. <laughs> <laughs> 